Hello, my friends of Cotary Labs. My name is Jorge Toya. Please welcome to this tutorial. In this tutorial, we are going to create an applied example of geological modeling, okay, uh, with GenPy, but with a version of GenPy that is the GenPy app that is a, a that is a tool that creates a that creates a geological model with GenPy and provides your result, okay. Uh, this tool is online, so you have to what you have to do. Uh, we are going to create a example case right now. Okay, so first of all, you have to GenPy is GenPy app is under Aquifer app, so you have to go to aquifer.hatrilabs.com. You have to sign with your uh, Labs account. Okay, uh, you can create a project, geological model, okay, GMPI, just to give a name and a description, upload, okay, we go to edit, and here, well, you can do plots of Steve, you can run Frixie as well, but you can also run GMPI, okay, so we... In this case, GenPy is containerized, okay? And what does it mean that it's containerized? That we are uh, running a container that runs GenPy. And we, why we do that? Because we need a distribute, okay? In our side, we have a distributed computed, um, computer system. So where we can host the requirements of many users, okay? In many computers. Okay, so let's see. Please wait till the that stops. Okay, so we go to view. Okay, so it goes from zero to two thousand. From zero to two thousand. From zero to seven hundred fifty, and the resolution will be fifty, fifty, fifty. Select. Okay, we need an orientation file in the description of the video. Mm, in the description of the video, you are going to find the you are going to find this folder that is the GenPy tutorial. Okay, and here uh, in the GenPy tutorial, you are going to have the orientations. These are the orientations. Okay, next. And we have also the point file that are the contacts. Okay, and I think this is the lower part of the contacts. Okay, and then we compile. Okay, so we have here the different geological units uh, shale, sealstone, so main fault, sandstone, shale, sealstone. Okay, and then we have to define if they are a strat or if they are fault. Okay, and then here we have to give the sequence. Okay, in this case, sandstone 1 is the oldest one. Sandstone 2 is the uh, newest one. Shell is the order 3 and sealstone is the order 2. Okay, so we do upload. Uh -huh. Okay, and here you can see the folds, some series with their colors, okay, and some uh, information about the points and the orientations, okay, in the different directions. Okay, great. So what we are going to do next is that we are going to interpolate okay and this can take some time okay this takes around 150 seconds okay and uh, due to some timeouts okay so it actually says that the interpolation running that the geological interpolation running and then we have to wait okay but in fact a uh, uh, we can what um, 
okay this will take some time okay i'm going to make a pause here okay around uh, two minutes half elapsed so we can refresh the plots okay and if we refresh the plot uh, and says that okay we don't say we don't see that the interpolation is running so and the results are already here okay so what we uh, do need is to just click here and then we are going to see the results and these are the results in the uh, x-axis in the y-axis and on the z-axis okay well great so this is the uh, this is the tool that we have Okay, later on we are going to put some features here to download, maybe, the results, and then we are going to couple that with some scripts in Python. Okay, as you have seen, the process is really, really, really easy, and we hope that you can enjoy this tool, and we hope that you can follow this tutorial as well. Okay, have a great day. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.